Okay, it's about that time. Let's do another lot walk. Should be fun, plenty of new rides. Came into the lot this week. Welcome back guys. Nick up here at Maple Motors in Hendersonville, Tennessee and uh, got about what 10 new classic rides going on today. You can check us out maplemotors.com. We do have finance and we do have shipping available and test drives on every single car that comes through the lot. You can find all those in a playlist below. Cars currently available and of course week by week it usually takes till about Wednesday to get all the test drives up and running kind of space them out you don't want to post 10 videos in one day so I, I, I spread them through the week we do have financing you can go get pre-approved we do have shipping you can send it straight to your house and you can get a quote it's just all there at maplemotors.com with 100 detailed pictures so don't forget to check that out check the description out below I give you links going straight to the website and of course, all the information you may need to know about us. There's a bio. And of course, we've been here 40 years and we're a family owned business. In this video, I'm gonna be walking around. I'll tell you the year, I'll tell you the model, I'll tell you the price. Let's get started. 67 Chevelle sitting here on the front row. Price at 34.9. And then, of course, right next to that one is a 71 Chevelle. This one's silver, priced at $27.9 with a vinyl top. Got the bucket seats. Right here beside that is a 72 Chevelle. This one's set up more of a drag car. It's got the big block under the hood. And it's priced at $26.9. 70 Chevelle, the most popular year. This one's got the black stripes, vinyl top. Priced at $32.9. Aftermarket set of wheels. New to the website, 69 Chevelle. Bucket seats. Hot little motor. And it's priced at 31.9. What about the 69 Chevelle sitting right here on the end? This one's priced 39.9. Beautiful paint job. With the bucket seats. If you want to see all the motors, just go to maplemotors.com. We have 100 detailed pictures, and we also have those test drive videos coming out explaining everything. Biggest reason I don't do all the motors in this walk around video is all the new cars I don't necessarily know personally myself. I like decoding them all myself. So each video I decode them and then tell you about it. It's just like I'm going to buy the car myself, pointing out all the stuff that you need to know about. Just makes sense, right? Okay, here on the right side of the lot, we got a 1972 Pontiac GTO. And of course, this one's priced at $29.9. Next to that, a 1968 Cutlass. The white vinyl top. Priced at 
What about a 72 Dodge Charger? We've got it priced 19.9. Right next to that is a 1972 Monte Carlo, blue with white stripes. Priced at 17.9. Back 1966 Buick Riviera. This one's priced at 12.9. And then of course the 61 Cadillac sedan. This is a four-door car. Big fins on the back, priced at 12.9. Okay, you guys have a few new ones back here. This one just came in, old Monte Carlo. And the El Camino. What? This one's priced at $11.9. It's a 1980 El Camino. I gotta do a video on this one. I haven't done it yet. That came on uh, Friday at the last minute. Got cleaned up. So I was never able to do the video. And then right next to it is the Monte Carlo. This one's an 86 model. And it's priced at $79.50. It's honestly a pretty nice car all the way around. I did the video on it. And hopefully I'll have that video out for you today. Got a GMC truck. An old uh, C10 sitting right next to it. Of course this one here is new to the website as well priced at 14.9 it's a 69 c10 pickup that's another one i've already got the video done so go check it out next it is a 66 gmc stepside priced at 19.9 and this one's got a 305 v6 yes they made that they had a few v6 motors in that year unique little motors Worth checking out. This one here also new to the website. LS powered S10 from 2001. I haven't messed with it yet to do the video on that, but I will be hustling to get it done today. pretty sweet all right let's jump on over into the showroom I've got a lot more cars to show you but today there's a El Camino sitting out here in the middle we'll stop with it this is a 67 model Chevrolet El Camino priced at 24.9 big block under the hood all right guys let's hit up uh, the Hot Wheels room check out the showroom and continue the lot walk once again, we're in Jim Fights Hot Wheels room. You can check it out here on YouTube. I think you'll enjoy it. We go over the whole entire room. My little sister, she's been taking care of the majority of that. Join us on Instagram. Got a Hot Wheels channel there. She posts cars every single day for sale. She'll go through all the special ones and take pictures of them and put details up, how much they are, shipping, and honestly, she's very efficient at it. So check it out on Instagram. Check it out on YouTube, and I hope you enjoy it. That's Jim Fights Hot Wheels channel. Let's get back out there to the uh, car lot. This is literally located on premises, so if you come here to the lot, say, show me the Hot Wheels to Pops in the main office, and he'll bring you over here. Let's get back out. So in the showroom, we've got this 1941 Willys Coupe, priced at 45.9. It's pretty much a show car, a lot of custom work done. We're checking out. Up here in the front of the showroom, we got a 1954 Ford F100. And this one's priced at $34.9. Got a custom headliner. 
custom interior, bed cover, step side, matching wheels. And of course on this one, we just had to charge the battery up. This one's a uh, air ride truck, fully customized. Nice bed, nice interior. And it's a 12.9 uh, piece, 1989 S10. Also got the 350 under the hood. If you like our merchandise, you can check it out at maplemotors.com. It's on the left or below in the description. You can also pick up, you know, the banners, t-shirts, cups, anything you may need. Thanks. Let's get back out there. Of course, we got a whole row of cars back here. We're going to start over in the corner. What about a 97 Silverado pickup truck? It's a 1500. Priced at $69.50. Full test drive, description video online about that. This one's new to the website. At 9950, 1967 Chevrolet Stepside pickup truck. And a little bit of a project, but that's why it's priced 9950. Next to it, another 67, but this is the uh, straight bed on it, 9950 on it. Lift it up in the air, aftermarket wheels and tires, and the bench seat, and the four speed. Pretty sweet. This one's new to the website as well. And we got it priced 10.9. It's a 1966 uh, Dodge convertible Dart. And then next to that, got old 91 Firebird T-Tops. 89.50 is the price. Next to that, an 80 model Chevrolet Corvette priced at $79.50. And then last but not least on the project row. Got an old Chevelle. This one's priced $19.9 from 1971. Check this out. They got it set up like a gasser. It's a 1967 D100 Dodge pickup. It's got the Hemi, priced at $24.9. That was a pretty sweet video. It's got some slicks on the back. Big old fat slicks. Go check out that video, I think you'll enjoy it. Okay, right here on the side of the office. This is a 1975 Chevrolet Impala. And we got it priced at $19.9. Still a lot to show here. This one's new to the website, old 70 Chevelle. I like this car a lot. Did the test drive already, I'll be putting it out today. Uh, just got a whole lot going for it. Priced at 36.9, aftermarket wheels, disc brakes, custom interior, custom paint. That was worth the look. Next to the Chevelle is a 87 Monte Carlo SS. And we got it priced at 14.9. Now to the Mustang row here, 1970 model Mustang convertible, priced at 22.9. What about the fastback? This is actually a coupe, but it's a they got it set up as a fastback with flares. It's a 65 model Mustang, priced at 19.9. So she's a clone car. It's on the windshield too. Fastback clone. Next to that one, we got a 65 model Fastback for real. Priced at 32.9. 289 under the hood. Nice interior. Another convertible sitting here. It's a 67 model. Priced at thirty-seven 
And then another fastback. This one's a inline six cylinder three speed car. Price at 329. Okay, new C10 truck sitting out here. We'll get to it in just a second. Got a row of Camaros. Well, excuse me, there's a Firebird sitting here. Of course, right here, it's a 79 Chevrolet Camaro. This is a Z28. Priced at 16.9. Next to it, probably the still the fastest car on the lot, a 67 Pontiac Firebird. And this price 27.9. What about a 73 Chevrolet Camaro? This is a Z28 car at 29.9. And then, of course, here on the end is a 72 Camaro in yellow with the vinyl top at 32.9. Man, this warm weather coming in today is reminding me of taking them out to the cruise ends. It's getting ready to happen again. Let's kick this cold weather out. Start driving some cars out to the shows. Of course, you got the old... Uh, Chevrolet sitting there. I'm going to let him look at it first before we mess with it. That one just came in. New to the lot. Let's go check it out real quick. He just walked away. This one's got the patina set up. Aftermarket set of billet specialties. Very nice interior. It's all customized. Headliner's been done, aftermarket steering wheel. Runs and drives awesome. It's a 79 C10 pickup truck. Priced at 19.9. And yes, I already did the video. I snatched that one as soon as it came in. This looks like it's chipped. It's not, it's made that way. They went for the look. Turned out pretty well. We're gonna walk around the lot one more time, just glance over some stuff. Again, we are a family business, 40 years. We're on TikTok, Instagram, Facebook, Snapchat, all the social medias, just go on them, type in Maple Motors, and we'll put all kinds of different content on all the channels that we have. If you're on this channel currently, hit subscribe and share this video, that'll help me out quite a bit. I like doing the lot walks and then test drives going over the flaws. I pick out the flaws so you know what you're getting before you get here. You haven't seen it before it's basically like i'm going to buy the car myself I'm just looking around the whole thing trying to uh describe it correctly check for rust dents bondo all the good stuff and then of course our website offers detailed pictures financing and shipping Coming up from the back here. We got a, a few project cars we store right here. And we do put some of these on the channel as well. We've got uh, everything from show cars to project cars. Even in the mid-range. And then sometimes they'll sell before I can list them. And we have a whole carport full of them right here. These are cars that have sold. Some you've seen, some you haven't. But I do like to run through and show you the sold cars. You can see they're all marked. If they're not, they will be. <laughs> Just 
kind of showing you what we've had though. But these are just waiting to be shipped out. I love this body style right here. This thing looks awesome. It's coming on up here. Got the old gasser looking truck. This thing's sweet. A lot of fun right there. Impala. I haven't test drove this one yet. I'm excited with the LS motor in it. I don't think I've ever drove a uh, 2000 model. Or that's a 01 S10 with an LS in, in it before. And this is really unique with the V6 in it. People were calling me out, it's 305, it doesn't have that. No, it is. There's three different models of V6s that came in this truck. It was something I had to learn too. Because we haven't had one of these before with that motor. I did not know that this was in here either. This is another test drive I'm gonna have to get to today. That's awesome. Jason, he's inside there. He said it ran strong. I didn't realize that was under the hood. Sorry about that compressor there. I'm sure that's loud. Guys, what was your favorite car from the update? I'm having to think a second. I really like the white Chevelle. I'm a huge fan of white cars. But I'm just double thinking I haven't drove everything I'm gonna say this one right here is my favorite car go ahead and pick it out let me know what you think leave it in the comments I'd like to know hear from you and each week week by week we'll put out new rides for you detailed pictures finance and shipping all the good stuff all I need from you is to hit subscribe and share this video that helps me out quite a bit guys Again, thank you for watching, and I'll see you in the next video. Later, guys.